Remind yourself that overconfidence is a slow and insidious killer. Hello everybody, I've been live on Twitch for exactly 30 seconds and I have already had to ban a bot, so that's a great start. <laughs> uh, oh, I scared the cat off by laughing. I have a, oh no, he's back. I have a cat on the desk. I hope everyone's doing well. Oh, Alright, let's um, have to keep an eye on the Twitch chat, I think. I did manage to purge that. I don't know if that made it to the actual... Did I go to look into the live chat? It doesn't look like it did. Okay, let's have to keep an eye on. How is everybody doing? We are going to play some Terran Vita today. There it is there. In all of its glory. The biggest question I have to ask myself is, do I want to play with the original game music or do I want to use Synthwave? Because I have played so much Terra Invicta, that music is ingrained in my my soul. I think I'll I think I'll do it to start with. <laughs> Classic Twitch bots indeed. Hey T Rem, hey Subbed Out, hey Brian Jewhurst, good to see you. Hey him. Um, two five one four Ben eighty eight. That's a fun one to say. Uh, Don Vincenzo, good to see you. Hey Richard Brackman. Uh, did I miss anyone else? I don't think I did. Um, thanks everyone. For but coming into this really weirdly timed stream. Yes, Terra Victor has just had a really big update and I'm keen to see if it's any good. Uh, the, 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 I'm really sad that I never actually got to the end of my my playthrough before. Um, we, we really did run, I ran out of steam essentially. We got to Jupiter, things were going pretty well, but I really just struggled to, 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 to finish and I really want to give it a gun. Hey, Silver Great Fox, it's nice to see you. Thanks for joining the stream. Let me just get this, this synth wave turned off. Hey, no time left. How's it going? Thanks for dropping by. Um, and there it is. There's the uh, turn with music. Let me just untick this so that I can alt tab and you won't lose the music. I should fix up a couple of things really quickly, make sure my overlay is correct. I've got test this. Hey, Crash Test, good to see you. Might get some Crash Test Marines. Okay. Oh, and I've got the replit running. Everything is good. Let's start a new game. So we're going to play the modern scenario, full solar system, all eight factions. Um, as people have mentioned, as Tiram has mentioned, the Discord has voted for Project Exodus, which is what I understand is one of the hardest ones to to complete to win us because uh, excuse me, it requires so much investment in space travel, um, and it's really hard to do. So that's what we're going for. Um, Let's, uh, normal difficulty, I think. We'll start the long campaign. I don't think there's any customization we want to do. We'll just leave everything on its defaults. There's nothing here I think I want to change. There is um, this option here. Display the status of projects that have been triggered and not yet unlocked or been missed by your faction in the campaign. Um, I'm really not sure if I want to turn that on or not. I think we'll just leave everything as default. Let's just let's just start, um, start a long campaign and let's see how we go. See how long this takes to load as well, because that was a, definitely an issue in the past. The loading times, uh, I used to start the game quite a long time before. Hey Reno, how's it going? Good to see you. We did lock down the system pretty well. That did go well. Reverse homeworld, oh yeah, <laughs> that's a good way to put it, reverse homeworld, I like that. Re Exodus is your only win so far. I'll be relying on you heavily for advice. One of my plans with this playthrough is that we are going to m mostly, at least for the early game, ignore the EU and America, which I know is sacrilege, but with the way that the game has changed, um, we should be able to make do with other well-developed nations. We're probably gonna have a look at um, Asia Pacific, but the other reason for that is to give the AI a chance to actually establish itself in some good countries. Um, and, and that could actually help us a lot. Okay, so we've got two Exodus um, Exodus experts, that's hard to say, in chat, which is going to help me out a lot. I need to remember how to play this game. It's like been two years since I played it. I've got Mishap's name code up and running. Yes, I set up a Replit account. It's all, it's all ready to go TRM, but thank you for checking in. Um, for, I'm like, I'm excited. I, I really enjoyed 
Terror Victor was the first game I really streamed extensively, and I did really enjoy those late night streams where we just like got on with the task of saving the world, you know? We remember the day the stars on Ooh, That's very jerky. The day we learned we were not alone. I'll probably we'll see if I can success. We might take it the slow way. Rose on an unfamiliar universe. Some of us saw wondrous possibility and others existential danger. I don't think this cutscene the existed the first time I played the game. That the bright streak in the sky was no natural phenomenon. Most of us didn't really believe them until it burned through our atmosphere and crashed in a remote region, leaving only wreckage and uncertainty. You know, if it was down to me, I would have played now a academy fraction, taking refuge in our most primal emotions. Each of us saw what we wanted to see. Yeah, Australia supremacy exactly. First, to awaken to an unfamiliar home. To open your eyes. Oh, that's right. It's, that it's a theme of opening on which faction you're playing. Forever. Forever. Because as a resistance leader in the subway, has long been the price of wisdom. There comes a time when we must accept change, no matter how great. Oh, I'll fix that. Thank you for pointing there it out. It does. It does crash we must quite often. All leave home. I'll fix the chat. I know what to do. We do this. We do this. We do this. We do this. We do this, and we do this. Also, I might need to move chat, because it's actually not in a great place. I think I used to have it up here. We'll see how that goes. Okay, UFO crashes on Earth. Breaking change with this update. The Academy's good. This update killed an Academy run. Oh, no. UFO alien crash crashed in the Nymer region of Niger. While the wreckage is not recovered, we suspect an alien life form escaped into the surrounding countryside. Greetings, Director. The Council has appointed you leader of our organization. I am Khalid al -Ashka. You've got two musical tracks playing on top of each other right now. Crash landing represents both That's great really confusing to my ear. And great danger. As such, we have formed a small I've got Chang Kong. I do have Chang Kong Station. <laughs> in astrophysics, intelligence analysis, and space exploration. We must learn what these creatures are, where they came from, okay. and what they plan. We know what we're doing. Have a council investigate the alien activity mission at mission the mission crash site. Okay. Ooh. We're having a little bit of lag. And that seems to be okay now. How's the frame rate? It's looking a little bit laggy in my stream preview. The Earth looks a lot more detailed than I remember it being. A lot more detailed. It looks like they've maybe they've upped the um, texture on the planet, uh, and we should have more. Th I think there's more regions in America. There's more regions in a few other places as well. I think Africa has had a big upgrade, but I think we're going to focus on this part of the world. I think we're going to maybe start with Australia or start with New Zealand. Yeah, the music sings. Uh, or New Zealand. Um, I would also very much like to maybe get our hands on um, Taiwan, get our hands on Japan, get our hands on South Korea, get our hands on Singapore. But let's just have a look at what we're starting out with. So we've got a cash income of 9.7. We've got an influence income of 16.1, 20 ops. We've got two mission control, and we're generating one research a day. Hey, Arkin, Arkin, thanks for dropping by. It's, it's good to see you too. Uh, who do we have to start with? We've got Catherine Prater. Let's go into our, um, ooh, we've got a thing here to show the progress of our, th our three research projects later on. That's really cool. Let's have a look at our agents. So Catherine Prater, she's a diplomat. She's currently in Brisbane. She's got Perception 7, Investigation 5, Espionage 5, Command 3, and Mission 5, Science 1, Security 5. She's not terrible for a starting agent. That Perception 7 is it's actually pretty nice. And we also have a kingpin in Darcy Markle, Perception 4, Investigation 2, Espionage 4, Command 5, Admission 7, Science 0, Security 7, Loyalty, Potentially 1. She's not so good. What are your traits? Okay. She has Government, Family Ties, which will get... So don't get Australia nuked. She's got Connected, and she's got Inscrutable, which never seems to express an opinion. Apparent Loyalty set to 12. Um, is this game is like XCOM? Anyone known Xenonauts? Except instead of controlling XCOM, you're controlling you're you're taking the fight into space. Uh, so we will be a really good thing to kind of make it akin to is the three body problem. I would say, and anyone in chat can can attack me for that for saying that. We've just discovered aliens exist. And there's various factions that have come up. Some of them are going to try and kill the aliens. Some are going to try and join the aliens. We're going to get out of Earth. Um, hey, Winter Wolf, good to see you. Oh, I'll be taking I'll be taking it. Yeah, it's XCOM here to deal with the background politics and the squad missions are high off screen. Okay, so she doesn't seem like a bad start. Let's get up the replit and let's give her an, a, a new name. So I will ask for a new councillor name. Uh, is, if this is going to work. 
It looks like it's crashed. Let me just try rerunning it. I'm not going to take this too quickly. I'm going to be quite chill here. Uh, see. Oh dear, I can't get this to work. <laughs> okay, I got it to work. Um, say hello to our new... Our new um, I feel like... I got I got what I would say is a distinctly male name, but that doesn't really matter. This is um, this is Human, um, our first counselor. So I'm getting this name from the name list on the Discord, um, and that is the name of our first counselor. And we're probably going to get rid of Darcy at some point. She's got a criminal, veteran, family ties, rich, connected, center. What does she have? Defend, interest, surveil, location, protect, target, control. So she does have control. Detain, purge, sabotage, assassinate, steal, project, coup d'etat, increase, unrest, extract, assault, hostile. Set national policy, go to ground. She doesn't have everything we really need. You've got defend, advise, surveil, investigate, control, turn, control, stabilize, set national policy, go to ground. So she's got, she's only got control nation. Let's get a name for Darcy as well. Is this going to work? I'm having a few issues with the program. This is Elint Danger. Oh, these names. Okay, we've got Elint danger as our second and since we've got it let's let's also name our station so um it's not changong station you've been mistaken it is actually uh how do i customize this again and i need to go in here it's actually avalanche breaker station i wonder what we can do with having a station in the in in the air is the music a bit too loud let me get back to chat Oh, there's so much to do. I'm okay. Although this game's still very no, this game is out. It's very out, Angel. Uh, there's lots of combat. It's just all in space. Yeah, that was the name I introduced last night. Uh, there is combat. There's lot. There's space battles. Um, Arkin, Arkin. Like quite detailed space battles, but it will take a while before we get to them. We currently have modern day space technology. So if we wanted to get a combat ship into space, we would have to look at doing something like. Uh, let me. Can I actually design ships this early? How do I do that again? Fleets? Ships classes? No, I can't even design ships. I don't even have chassis to design ships with yet. Okay, let's let's actually look at starting the game. So I have... Well, who's in the recruitment pool at the moment? We've got a tech mogul, we've got a diplomat. Can't afford him. Okay, we need 60 ops before we can afford a decent agent, so we'll wait for that. Um, we need to send somebody to investigate the alien site. So, um, human can control nation, stabilize nation, surveil, go to ground, or investigate alien activity. Standing I think by for orders. we can't send Elint Danger to investigate, so we're going to have to send Human to investigate the crash down site in Niger. Now. For Elint, Elint Danger, can they actually do anything useful? Increase unrest, sabotage, surveil, protect target, go to ground. There's nothing they can actually do to help us take Australia. Um, pretty much. Pretty much, we we can. That's that's it. The reversed. The music's a bit much. Okay, let's turn that down. Thanks. Oh, hey, Andrew Bosco. I hate somebody. I thought the music might be a bit loud. Uh, cancel. I didn't want to do that. I want to go to settings, and we want to go to audio. And let's just turn the master volume down first. And I'm gonna also bring the music volume down on top of that as well. That sounds better to my ears. Let me know how that goes. So we can't actually get them to do anything. Let's just check everything else. So status of Earth is we control nothing. Um, no point checking the solar system. Our council we've already checked. Nations we don't need to worry about. Haves we don't need to worry about. Fleets and ship construction we don't need to worry about. Let's have a look at our research. So at the moment, we're researching. We're not alone. So she'll just consider what the inner means for human institutions. We've got Global Skywatch. Um, the Consolidation of Advanced Aerospace Surveillance Systems. We've got Mission to Space. We learn how to live and thrive in a vacuum. Now, we have all of our research current... Excuse me, going into audience research. We're studying new ways of influencing the project. What other projects do we have? So audience research gets us 25 ops. Commercial research gets us 100 money. Management gets us um, control point by five. And ops gets us, so we probably want to be working on audience. Um, that's a good shout, TRM. Yes, I will do that. If you're just in customer experience the reverse, you can change something to uncrypt the saves or edible JSON files. Oh, cool. Um, there are mods to the reverse. This has actually got the workshop. There's someone is making a three body problem mod. I saw that when I was looking today. I was trying to load a mod. I think the mods, all the mods haven't been updated yet. Also, I noticed the chat still isn't working. Um, which is really sad. Let me just try one more time to fix that. Um, I wonder why it isn't. It was working before I started the stream. I don't know why it's not now. 
We'll give it a couple seconds. The game is very, very moddable, yeah. Okay, we'll, we'll leave all this as it is. Um, let's see if Elin Danger can get an org to make her more useful. So we've got the Horizon Fund, which gives 3% knowledge. Pupus Interactive, which gives what, plus one science and plus 5% um, information science research. Andromeda Entertainment, which gives plus one persuasion. Not perception, it's persuasion. And we have plus one espionage. Um, Holy German Industries gives plus one science. There's nothing really here. The only thing I could think of doing would be actually grabbing Andromeda Entertainment for Human, um, which would make her a lot better at Control Nation. Um, that's going to cost us nothing monthly, but give us an ops income. I think that's worth grabbing. I'm going to purchase that for her. That's going to cost us 51. says, I don't think chat has worked at all today. Are you no. sure it's not hidden behind Terra and Victor, or is that not how it works? No, it's definitely here. I can see it on top. It's just not displaying anything. I don't know why. Annoying. It might be because I'm streaming to Twitch. Um... I don't want to spend too long. We used to always have problems with chat in Terra and Victor. I remember this. And then it started working. I can't remember what I did to fix it. Oh, yes. Um, the first spot. Don Vincenzo gets the first spot. Uh, where's my text option? Video capture, screen capture, alert box. Where's another chat? Widgets. Chat box. Add source. Add a new source. Chat box 2. I'm just going to try re-adding this and just see if that does anything. There you go. That's working. I don't know why this one is working and the other one isn't. We'll put it about here. I think that's the best place to put it. And then I'll turn off the other chat box. Okay. So that's working. <laughs> Sorry, somebody. You missed out. If you go on to Twitch, you can, there's a separate bot running on Twitch, so you can do it there. All right, let's get on with the game. So we've got, we've got that org for Human. They're going to go and investigate. We need 60 ops in order to... Um, to, uh, to 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 get things going. Let's confirm. Well, what we're we going to do with her then? There's no point surveilling. There's no point sabotaging. There's no point increasing unrest. Honestly, she's probably fireable. Like, what do I want to? There's just nothing to do with her. I could give her a chance to control a nation, but like Australia, there's no chance, right? Um, New Zealand. There's a twenty. We'll just give her a control nation attempt on New Zealand, but she's not going to make it. Establishing our presence. Well done, Naughty Jug. All right, let's uh, confirm assignments and let's... Uh, where's end turn? Wow, I cannot find the end turn button. Oh, no, it's not end turn, is it? It's press play. All right, and we can pick the speed up a little bit. Okay, and here we go. <laughs> you lost the competition, didn't even know you were on yet. <laughs> uh, how is everybody doing? Thank you all for tuning in. All right, select management team. We may now recruit our faction's management team. As we stand at Project Exodus operations, we are selecting our internal management team to help oversee our affairs. While we're guiding ourselves for a variety of disciplines, it's your discretion will emphasize a particular specialty. Lobbyists and influencers will get us monthly influence income up by three, which will be very useful in the early game. Scientists and engineers will give us research up by 15, which will help us get ahead in the research game. Officers and operators will, give us, will just give us 50 ops. Um, and then finance office will give us money income. I think I want to go for the influence because the influence is going to be very important early game. It's not going to be important that badly later. Unless you go to New Zealand, I we'll have to pursue different opportunities. Pretty much, that's what's going to happen someday, for sure. Um, I'm going to grab the extra influence. I think that's what I want to grab because we need 60 influence to hire a, a good agent. What can I put on the space station? Nothing yet. I need boost. Um, I have no boost at all, so I can't actually boost anything from the planet up into space to actually do anything to the space station yet. The growing realization that we are not the sole sapient spirits of the universe is causing many to see their fellow humans in a new light, leading to hopes that we can overcome our capacity for strife to address the alien arrival as one people. Let's try to set aside our differences and go forward together. Recon complete. I have learned some useful information from my investigation of the UFO crashed on site in Niger. We will receive a small bonus to our research going forward. Cool, that's done. An amazing turn of events, Director. Let us hope they have come in peace. <laughs> they have not. <laughs> I'll tell you that for free. We've got 20 influence and 20 research. Despite heavy security, we've been able to gather some debris from the crash site. Our assignments will be to these, these audio stings are hilarious. Most of the game is in space, Silver, yeah. They, they, we can put guns... We, we, used to have, we used to have battle stations. We had Weed Station 1 that just grew space weed last time. I'm looking forward to getting another Weed Station up in space. Um, okay, research alien signatures. That's fine. I, can I actually start that research now? 
Um, no, I can't. It hasn't popped up yet. Okay. So it looks like Project... It looks like the Initiative is pushing Mission to Space. It looks like the Servants are pushing Skywatch and nobody is researching We Are Not Alone. So the way the research in this game works for anyone who is new is these global research at the top where all of the factions contribute their research together to research um, these big button things like you know fusion reactors and spaceship parts and stuff. And then we have our own engineering project down here that are our personal research. So it's you're, you're kind of all progressing at the same speed because you're all researching together. And the more research you contribute to the global effort, you get to control research moves next, which is actually quite cool. Um, new project available. Alien, okay, Alien Signatures is now allows faction to detect alien abductions on Earth. We definitely want to get that research, so let's change this to Alien Signatures Research. It only requires 25 research. We'll select that project. Again, 100% of our research is going into that right now. We still lack support. And she failed to take over New Zealand, which I'm very disappointed in her for. Oh, we've got a heist kicking off. I like how the narrative is more cautious curiosity rather than jumping straight to leaving Earth right away since there is an immediate reason to do so. Yeah, that looks quite cool, actually. Okay, Don Vincenzo is getting a heist together. Be aware that if T Rem joins this heist, you are all going to die and lose your money. Just to warn you, um, is Chad okay where it is, or do I need to move it over slightly? Okay, well we look at we're looking here. So we've got a new turn. First things first, let's look at hiring a new agent. We really need to get some good agents. We're probably going to fire Elin Danger. Honestly, she's not very useful. Okay, so we've got Bol Bolvagin Drakala. He's a diplomat. Persuasion 7, Investigation 5. We want at least two people with high persuasion for the early game. Importantly, we need Control Nation, but we also need Purge. Um, does Actually, I think she does have Purge. She might be useful for that. Um, so Boglevin here has Control Nation and Persuasion 7. That makes him a really good... Um, person here. Check out um, this hacker with the, the knife scars. Also, is he here? Oh. Hijinx is not here. Uh, you don't know what a heist is? Heist is when you gamble your channel points, which you can spend to play sound files and do text-to-speech um, to get more. Who else we got? We've got a rebel here. Oh, we've got an evangelist here with Persuasion 8. Um, he has Control Nation. He also has Public Campaign, which is very useful. He also has Inspire. He also has Crackdown. Um, that's very useful. The problem with Crackdown, though, is he um, doesn't have any investigation. So even though he has Crackdown, it's going to be a while before he can use it. Um, there's a politician here. Do they have Crackdown? They do have Crackdown and Control Nation and Public Campaign. Um, they might be a good pickup. Willie Unger. They have got Government, Beloved... Monthly income plus three plus one persuasion, and they get inspire loss of so minus one loyalty for every crude hab belonging to the faction that's destroyed. Um, they're a demagogue, an influential rebel rest who plays the basis into the public. Minus six to espionage will be detected by other counselors. Plus persuasion nations where, okay, Tech, he's a cynic, so minus three apparent loyalty. He's a technocrat, um, and he's careless. We don't like careless. We don't like careless agents. That does put me against him. Um, what about this guy? Connected, affluent, government, loss averse. I'm kind of tempted by the evangelist, honestly. Um, he's 52 years old, though, which also puts me off. I'm helped. This guy's 34. Okay, we're going to grab, grab Bolgevind here. Um, what happened? Only one man survived the heist. Who survived? I missed I missed it in the, the chat. Who survived? Naughty Jughead is the only person who came back. I told you if, if T-Rem joined that heist, you're all going to die. Um, that's a good point. We need someone who can um, increase popularity. Are there any... Public campaigning is what we want, but can Boglevin public campaign? Boglevin can't. Who's the other person I was looking at? Willie Unger can public campaign. He's 46. I don't really like him, though. <laughs> I think we're going to pick up Boglevin right now for the Control Nation, and then we're going to have to pick somebody else up who can do... Um... The, the heists are very, very, very brutal. Very brutal. Um, uh, that's all I'm going to say. Uh, I'm going to recruit Boglevind. We're going to rename him. So let's, uh, I'll get the tool back up. I want a new counselor name, please. Okay, I don't know. Who, oh, I know what this is named after. Ladies and gentlemen, it's Jebediah Kerman. Jebediah. I really like the name generator. It always makes me smile. Kerman. Confirm changes. Okay, Jebediah Kerman is here. Um... There's nothing that's going to give him the ability to persuade. We now have two people who can control nation. So what we're going to do is we're going to get Human to do a control nation in New Zealand. I think we're going to try to take New Zealand first and then move into 
um, Australia. So we'll do a control nation here. I'm not going to spend extra influence on it because I don't really have very much. We'll get Elan Danger to also try. And we'll get Jebediah, I think, to come in too on New Zealand. And we'll just hit it three times. There's two points to take. Let's see if we can grab any of them. Oh. The aliens are our saviors. It's the servants. And all who oppose them are enemies of the future. Jeb is going to survive. <laughs> he tried driving the victim to the doors. Um, I think you all fell off the cliff in the Beatles. Okay, so the servants are here. They are the bad guys, as close as we can get to bad guys. Them and the protectorate. Forms, or Xenosapiens. They're this... demons incarnate. They and the traitors who support them will face our judgment. So Humanity First is another faction we've encountered. They are kill the aliens and anyone who helps them. Um, and they will do anything to do that. We do not really want them to get their hands on nukes. That is something that we need to be careful of. The Resistance have also are, grabbed a... Um, they've grabbed Australia, so we need to get that off them. UN Security Council meets. UN Security Council has met to discuss alien arrival. Unfortunately, the hope for a show of international unity did not materialize, with China, Russia, and the United States accusing each other of hiding knowledge about the alien crash and preventing full access to the site. We have an opportunity to shape events to our advantage. Each will make our case, even make our case directly to the nations of the world. However, with the eyes of the world in these meetings, our council's risk of exposure to our enemies is extremely high. So we've got Remain in the Shadows, which gets us 30 ops. We've got Quietly Steer Support for Project Exodus. Grants a small public opinion boost for Project Exodus around the world. Information about Project Exodus will be exposed to our enemies. Or we can deliver our manifesto, which gives us a big public. I think I'm going to do a Quiet Support. Our I think only I hope is to understand what the aliens want with us and determine how to satisfy them without losing our independence. I don't want us to be too obvious to start with. I'm looking here and Jebediah is aware to every faction. This is the Protectorate. They are even worse than the Servants. They just don't want us to leave Earth. So they are actually, one of their game plans is to build um, stations around Earth to shoot down anything that tries to leave Earth. Um, is Human also known to, yeah. All of our agents are known to everybody, mission which is not progress. great. I will report when my mission is complete. I will report when my mission is complete. <laughs> I'm gonna make I'm gonna make this these the Southern Star Republic uh, and combine Australia and New Zealand into one country, Winter Wolf. So get ready. Um, I love the political messing around in this game. We're gonna make. We're, I want to try and get the Pacific what Defense League together. Place? Cool. We now control one of the control points in New Zealand. So what we're gonna do is we can start setting priorities here. Um, now, priorities have changed a little bit from what I understand in this one. We still want to get as much mission control as possible. Having a look at New Zealand, they've got full democracy, they're peaceful, um, they've got advanced education, they've got homogenous culture, their GDP and their per capita is going down. We have lost Australia to... I don't think anyone's claimed Australia yet. Okay, Resistance and Humanity First are taking points in Australia. Don't worry, we can get it, we can get it back from them. Um, what I want to do is I want to boost mission control. This is the escape um, thing. So we don't want to worry about any boost. We don't want to, we don't want to fund boosting right now. Um, knowledge, I don't think we need to push knowledge here because it's already advanced. We need to get a little bit of economy. I want a little bit of welfare, a little bit of unity, but pretty much everything else going into mission control. Our presence is growing. Yes, the last time they, they were removed from, from... They were indeed. Okay, we got both control points in... We've got both control points in New Zealand. We now control New Zealand. I'm just going to copy this over. So I want one in welfare. I don't care about knowledge. We'll put one into funding, nothing into boost. And we've got mission control. We need to get mission control maxed out as soon as possible. Mission control is how we control stuff in space. It's really mission important. Is a no -go. That's okay. She failed, but that's because we already control the country. Now we need someone who can protect the country. I forgot how important that was. Um, so let's just have a look. Are there any agents available? The org marketplace has been updated as well. Are there any agents available who have the protect mission? Um, advise, control, steal. We're looking specifically for the protect. Defend, interest. So this guy here, Artem Abianstev, um, has defend interest at level three. What what type? It's a... Um, what is... What does defend interest use? It doesn't use anything. Okay, that's fine. So he's got defend interests. The servers just like they protect or betray their species because they prefer peace under unhuman terrain to conflict. Yeah, I don't care about knowledge. First, twenty twenty four. Oh, we'll get we'll get some more quotes. I'm sure. I've just moved my chat so I can see more of the history. Okay, so our time here has defined interests. Uh, you don't. Um, Michele Kameni here has as well. What I would like is someone who has. If I can get someone who has defend interests and can also promote for us, that would be amazing. 
So somebody with public campaign and defend interests. I don't like Willy Unger, though, because he has careless. Um, pushback does not. Sukair does not. Yeah, the cops The cops are going to take a break. Okay, so it's, it's basically Willy Unger or Artem. It's going to have to be Willy Unger. I didn't want to recruit him, but he's got Control Nation, he's got Public Campaign, and he's got Defend Interests. Yeah, it's the number of agents that have the mission. Okay, wait, do I already have people who have Defend Interests? Before I go into this? Uh, oh, okay. Human has Defend Interests. And Elant Danger has Defend okay. Interests. And Jebediah has it. Okay, that changes things immensely. I don't need to push that hard for Defend Interests then. What I need is someone who can public campaign. And that does mean we're going to have to hire Willy Unger because he has Persuasion 7 and public campaign. Um, the other option is Sukair, who has public campaign at 8, but he's he's 52 years old. He's a Pollyanna. Uh, apparent loyalty set to 25. Firebrand. Prosperous. Gives us some money. Fabitized Demanding. Plus two admin, plus one command, minus one loyalty every time a counselor rolls a critical failure. Untouchable, and he's an addict. So what's untouchable? Two points will be safely defeated. Any attempt to silence the counselor that has a result worse than critical success will give the assassin the marked trait, which provides a massive malice security attribute. I don't know listen to someone willing to go any length to acquire it. No, I don't. I think we're going to have to go with, These are both bad choices, but we're going to go with Willy. We're going to grab Willy Unger. Oh, I don't have enough for him. Damn it. We're going to have to wait another turn before we can grab him. Okay. He looks quite good for 52. Yeah, well, we'll see. We'll, we'll revisit it next time. Okay, Elant Danger is going to defend New Zealand just so that it's done. Our and then we're going to send Human and um, Jebediah to try and take what's left of Australia if we can. So 82% chance to take this. Oh, no, where did I just send her? I sent Ready her to... Order. Uh, um, not, not Australia. I sent her to Afghanistan. I want her to come here. I don't want to do this. How do I just tell her to come to Australia? Must have one control point initiated multiple control points to seek executive control point. Can I not just control the open one? Hey, Shinobo Mail. How's it going? Hey, uh, Mishaps as well. The um, bot's working fine. As you can see, we have Human, Elant Danger, and Jebediah Carmen. I'm just remembering how to play the game. We've claimed New Zealand so far. Why can't I target these? Because I need... In order to get these, I need to crack down, don't Ready I? I need the a skill that I don't what actually have access to at the moment. Okay, let's have a look at... Pick, do I want to pick up some Pacific states? Let's have a look at what else is available. Is Japan free? We can start taking Japan. Um, that could be a pretty good one, actually. Let's see if we can take Japan. 2% um, chance on Japan. What about South Korea? 9% chance on South Korea. Taiwan is a 32% chance. I always forget where Singapore is. It's, this is Singapore here. 42% on Singapore. That's pretty good for GDP. Oh, the huge update, Shinobi. There's been a huge update, which is why we're playing City Willie, our latest agent. He hasn't been hired yet, though. Let's see if we can grab Singapore. I'm going to send both of them to try and hit Singapore. At your service. Is that Australian accent new? We'll yeah, be I'm not pumping that no up. Time. I don't think there's anything else we need to do this turn. Let's confirm and we'll end the turn. Yeah, yeah that's exactly what it is. Control. That's exactly what it is, TRM. <laughs> Tank like the assassin. Thanks, Evelyn. <laughs> Evelyn and Denai, I like that one. Um, welcome to the stream as well. Oh, we've got 51 people here. That's crazy. This is such a weird time to be streaming. I'm surprised so many people are able to time in. Singapore is Switch. It's a pretty good one to grab. Just in terms of making our economy a little bit better in the early game. The best thing about this game, oh, I need what's the what's the hot key? Um, there we go. We need to keep an eye on this this whole mess on the left hand side of the screen. Um, we've got one level of Singapore. I'm just gonna wait to see if we get the other one. Okay, we failed to get the second one. In terms of priorities, um, they haven't even got a space program yet, so we're just gonna pump everything into space program to start with because um, we need we need to get mission control in Singapore as well. Okay, let's get Jebediah to spend a turn trying to get that. No, we'll get we'll get Human to do it. She's just much better. So we'll get her to spend a turn trying to take this point. We also need to hire a new agent. Um, and it is going to be. We still don't have enough. Oh, because I'm spending influence. That's right. Okay, we need to be. We need to spend a turn saving up influence to hire Willie. Um, one thing I need to check as well is we do have new orgs available. So there's Wolfhound Forge Co. Plus 13 money, plus... This is a... Wow. Wolfhound Forge Co. gives a lot of stuff for a very cheap... Um, oh, nice. That's great. Great to know, Shinobi. 
This is so uh, the Wolfhound Core is just an instant buy, right? Um, plus thirteen money, plus one for engineering, plus one science, plus one security. Yeah, we're, we're just going to get that. We're just going to purchase that right off the bat. That's for eighty-four money. That's fine. Um, we don't have enough to buy anything else. Pupus here gives plus twenty science, plus one science, plus five percent information science. I think I'm just going to grab that as well. Just start hoovering up some of these orcs. All right, so how much does a control cost? It, what's the base on it? What's the base cost of this ability? Spend influence, but how much influence? I need to know. Do we also want to try before I forget and take Kazakhstan? Oh yeah, we've got we've obviously got the Ukraine-Russia war going on. Although it looks like Ukraine are, are currently winning, which is so. Um, there's the Yasne Cosmodrome. But that's not in Kazakhstan. Here's Kazakhstan here, where we've got um, the ba Baikonur Cosmodrome, uh, which I almost did a podcast on. I'm, I'm glad you're you're getting some good sleep, uh, Winter Wolf. Do we want to try and take Kazakhstan? It's going to be a little bit away from everything else we take, but it's worth grabbing because they have that that they already have the the boost from the Cosmodrome. Thirty boost per year. I think we'll try and grab it. I think it's worth a, a, an attempt. Establishing control. And then we'll get Elan Danger Ready just to in. see what's going on here. There's not really much I can do with her right now. There's no point protecting Singapore until we've got both the points. Initiating recon. So we'll just see if we can detect any agents here. We believe we can join them as okay. brothers and sisters if we only convince them we are worthy. I don't need money, DRM. What's fine? Um, so we found the Academy. The Academy were the faction I would have played if it was my choice. They very much, they have an interesting story because they start off trying to see if they can like make peace with the aliens um, by showing that where they're as advanced and then find out they can't do that and kind of switch things up. And that's a good point as well, Crash Test. It will help us make use of the station. Okay, we've completed the Alien Signatures project. There is no doubt. Hey, Dark Cubie, how's it going? Yes, we are indeed. Um, Extraterrestrial life has touched down on Earth. Um, the many questions we have regarding its origin and species and its intent will have to wait. All that matters now is finding it. By cross-referencing reports of unusual events at the vicinity of the landing site with similar data from our global intelligence network, we've developed a tracking system able to reliably identify disappearances most likely resulting from alien activity. Allows faction to detect alien abductions on Earth. We did okay. not learn much, Director, but we have many prospects for future discovery. We're playing um, Exodus mishaps. Unfortunately, the samples we acquired were too small and limited to give us any real understanding of the alien spacecraft, uh, though it has left us with tantalizing clues. In other news, an alien survived the crash and has moved into nearby wilderness territory. Oddly, we received reports of disappearances in nearby communities. As yet, we have no explanation as to why. I don't think the Resistance know that that alien escaped. Um, okay, let's close that. Um, investigate, investigate alien abductions. Conduct surveil location missions in regions near any alien crash sites. If abductions are detected, send a counselor on an investigation alien activity mission to that location. <laughs> Research alien origin. Research the Skywatch and Deep System Skywatch global technologies and the, the, then the alien origin project when it becomes available. Salvage alien technology. Successfully engage one of the following alien a assets. A facility, a landed UFO, an orbital habitat, a warship or army, then research the alien technology project when it becomes available. That's all of our main objectives. Um, we seem to have lost the research we were doing before. Is it just... No? Oh, because, we, because we've got a second... I've got a second uh, one of these. We'll just pop some commercial research in there to get some money, but we're going to put all of our research into audience research. Whoops. All right. Let's continue the turn. Setting a watch. As I said before, it's nice that you can sit back and have a drink of coffee after each turn when you're playing this game, which I really like. It's all right, Kules. Good to see you. The Thanks for dropping is by. Not to look directly at what you are trying to see. Offset your focal point somewhere to the side of where you think you notice the movement. At night, the center of your vision doesn't work as well as during the day. I won't try to explain the science to you. What matters is you'll see whatever is out there before they see you. The span of time you Hans Castillo, hmm. advising conscripts in Colombia. The span of time humanity has spent in space is dwarfed by the span of time humanity has been interested in it. Earliest records of the telescope date to the 12th century. 
Um, allows all factions to track alien vessels and structures that are inside the orbit of Saturn. Immediately reveals all alien vessels and have that within our detection range. Okay. Uh, did we detect anything? Yes, we did. So we can now see that Victor 1 is on its way to Earth orbit, and Victor 2 is also on their way to Earth orbit, coming in from Saturn and Jupiter. So the aliens are coming. Uh, and that's what the, the Skywatch research lets us see. Uh, we are anti. We're, we're, we're anti Earth. Is what our what our faction is really doing. Um, what is what is what did they pick to research after that? So they've gone straight to deep deep system Skywatch. Okay, mission to space is about to complete as well. We were unable to establish control. That's annoying. We did manage to grab we're Singapore. We did grab at Kazakhstan. Wait, what is our control point limit? Okay, we're doing okay on control points at the moment. Is it worth... Yeah, is there a way to turn that off? Because it is really annoying. Um, I guess I could turn off... Um, notifications, maybe. Oh, wow. Okay, there's a lot in here. No, I don't want to mess with that. I think the only thing I really want to turn off is... I'd probably just turn... I'll, I'll look at this off stream. We'll leave it for now. See you, uh, Winterwolf. Thanks for dropping by. Good to see you. Um, we've just grabbed a few things. Uh, cool, S. We've basically grabbed New Zealand, a little bit of Singapore, and Kazakhstan. And I want to keep working on that. We're, we're going to struggle to get another agent until I finish grabbing these places. Uh, which is a little bit annoying because I really want to lock down Singapore. Um, but I don't we want to spend any in influence place. on it. And right. I want to continue grabbing Kazakhstan as well. Only a 14% chance here though. Can I do anything to make people like us more here? Not really. I really need that. Okay. Here's what we're going to do. We're just going to defend the point that we have in Kazakhstan. And we're going to defend the point that we have... Oh, wait. I just told her to defend Ready. the point. So, let me make sure I've got the right people. You are con taking Singapore. Taking control. Elin Danger, I want you to Ready come to Singapore and defend interests here. Securing and then Jebediah, I just want what you to defend you interests in Kazakhstan. So, we lose that point. No. Come back to Kazakhstan. Elin Danger. Jebediah Kerman, come back here. What? what, what? Can I not, how do I cancel this task? Why, why can I not tell him to... Okay, what if I just tell him to do a control here? Bringing them to our side. Okay, and then instead I want you to defend interests in Kazakhstan because I don't want to spend the influence this turn. <laughs> Indeed, cool S. Yes. Uh, confirm assignments and we're just... I just want to get up to we're 40 influence. For our people. Wait, just Making defending? For our also people. spend influence? Okay, that means I spent too much influence. Teaches that in the creation of heaven and earth, a wise people may. So that's mission to space done. Long. Let us heed those words and join together as we take our search into the stars. Director Khalid al from his khutbah at the first conclave of Muslim astrophysicists. So this gets us deep space propulsion concepts, orbital shipbuilding, outpost hams, and space tourism. If you're abandoned at home, there's all of our population technology and industrial activities. Surely we really want the aliens catch up to us a century later. <laughs> that is apparently the plan. So I accidentally spent all of our influence trying not to spend all our influence that turn, which is a little bit frustrating. That was my bad. Um, what do we have? We need space. Yeah. Just need to keep an eye on this. Select advisory team. We may now appoint our faction's chief advisors. With a management team on board, we may now recruit our core group of advisors to assist our interactions with oversight of nations aligned to our cause. Um, Economic development, national investment points to economy increased by 10%. National investment points to space flight increased by 5%. National investment points to boost increased by 5%. National investment points to military and build army. Welfare party. We're going to go for um, space flight and boost. So when the Exodus builds their great arc and runs away to some other system and finds aliens already living in the systems, are they going to pull their own alien invasion on some other chaps? Possibly. We still lack support. One thing to remember is that the aliens in this game are invading from a parallel universe, um, if I remember correctly. So they're not actually traveling distance. No, they are traveling distance. Never mind. We failed to get Singapore again. Is it worth just holding a turn? Um, unrest is high in Kazakhstan. Yeah, let's let's do something about that. Let's stabilize in Kazakhstan. Is that that's going to cost some? I mean, no. this nation. I really need to get I really need to get our influence up so we can recruit some new people. Um, how are things looking here? We've a long way to go before mission control is done here. Long way to go before space program is done here. I would like to grab the other point in Singapore before someone else steals it from us. 
but nobody else can steal it from us because we've got the only point. And same with Kazakhstan, nobody can steal the Kazakhstan point. Which reminds me, we should actually sort our stuff out here. We'll do economy, we'll do welfare. We, we don't need as much knowledge. Funding, I'm not gonna look at boost, and we will do mission control as well. Maybe a little bit more in welfare. Welfare is in a pretty bad state in Kazakhstan. Oh, sorry, I have already played through this game quite a lot. <laughs> I've got I got oh my, I got really really far through a resistance playthrough which I abandoned. Um, this is this is take two. So sorry about the spoilers. And I was also wrong about the spoilers. Parallel universe is not this game. It's Xenonauts. Um, yeah, any invade invaders. Yeah. Okay. What were we thinking? So if I wait two turns, I'll have enough to hire another person. And this is a cheap thirty influence guy available. There's a scientist for thirty. There's an astronaut for thirty. There's a tech mogul for thirty. We could maybe just hold for one turn and see what these guys are like. Um, I don't know what else I could do. Do you have advice as an ability? What am I doing? Um, you do not have advice. That alien came at us in Niger. I'm not sure exactly where that is in Ethiopia, Kenya, Congo, Tanzania. Congo. Where exactly is Niger in Africa? Sudan, Sudan. Libya. My, this is where my geography really lets me down. I don't know South Africa very well. Uganda, Tanzania. Because we can have a look around there to see if we can spot. I can't find it. Botswana, Nambia, Zambia. That's definitely not it. That's Tenerife. Um, well, I'm just thinking about what to do with everybody this turn since we're not going to be Okay, you can advise. Advise New Zealand for me. Apparently, advise is way more powerful now. I will help them. Oh, that costs ten influence. So I don't want to advise. Let's cancel that. Um, actually, you know what we need to do? I know exactly what we're going to do. You're going to go to ground. Evading pursuit. And you're going to go to ground because everybody knows where you are. Going into hiding. That's what we're going to do. We must not only defend human oh. lives from. We the finally aliens. found the resistance. We must ensure those lives remain worth living. Left coast. Okay, thanks everybody. <laughs> I will find it. Uh, is it spoilers if it's from this too? Neither one of African. No, I'll have another look next turn. Um, the resistance are basically XCOM. In this game, they are XCOM. Um, they want to beat the aliens, but they don't want to go too far with beating the aliens, basically. Hungering down. Going silent. So by going silent, it just means that the other factions don't know where those agents are anymore. Um, Morocco. Violence is abating. Cool. I forgot how much time you need to be you need to spend um, doing the old. There's. I found it. Audience research complete. This is a people put this. The required research to finish increased by 100 each time. Gets us 25 influence. I'm really happy we're doing that. We're going to repeat the project. Advice is stronger than better. The advisor, but these are early characters. But it's used for character can't do anything else of the turn. Yeah. I'm just. I'm trying not to spend influence. That's the biggest problem right now. Um, we could do some surveilling down here, though. We've got new orgs. Um, we have a bit of money, but not a lot. So there are some agents to grab for 30. We've got access to Kusha Abedi. I really need somebody with Crackdown, and I need somebody who can also public campaign. Um, so um, Kundin can public campaign, but they can't crack down. Um, this guy can public campaign, but can't crack down. This guy can control, they can purge, which takes control points from enemies, which is something we do need. Um, actually, what I need what I need is purge and public opinion. With a non-aligned movement, we chose no. Pretty much, Brian, yeah. Yeah, resistance is good XCOM, humanity versus spicy XCOM. That's exactly it, yeah. Um, this kingpin here has purge and control, but they don't have, I'm just looking for a very specific set. I'm looking for public campaign and and purge, basically which no one here seems to have. Control. Crack, so crack down, time to some of the benefits of a control point, removing any defenses and make it easier to purge. So we need someone with crack down, we need someone with purge. So we could we could take Artyom. Um, he has, we do already have somebody with purge. There's also Willy Unger. He has crack down and purge and public campaign. If we wait one more turn, we can hire him but it does mean spending a turn doing nothing. No, we're not Spicy XCOM. We're Project Exodus, we're, we're Runaway Calm in this game. 
I think I'm going to save it one more turn for Willy, which means we're not capturing any more... Um, we're not capturing any more locations, which is a little bit, a bit concerning. But I really want to get another agent before I really start pushing things. I'm just worried we're falling behind in like the early game scramble. How bad is the... We, we can probably just spend a turn um, reducing unrest Standing in Kazakhstan. Back. We'll turn down the hate. Where to? Ready. Restoring order. Yeah, I'm hoping the mid-game has been made better. They've they've reduced a lot of the weird, like a lot of the they've kind of put together a lot of the researches of, of drives that are very, very similar. Um, what can she do here? Sabotage surveil, protect target. There's really nothing for her to do this turn. I think we just won't give her uh, anything to do. One more turn and we can hire Willy, and that's kind of where I want, want to get things going. Once we've got Willy, we can really start the ball rolling, because um, we can start taking Australia. And that's what I want to do. I want to take Australia, I want to take Asia Pac, I want to take all of this area. I want to leave the rest of the world to the other AI players and see how that goes for us. It may go really badly. Things are cooling off. And we're just lowering the unrest in Kazakhstan, so they're less likely to riot. Nothing else really seems to be happening. Just keeping an eye on this down the side. Unfortunately, we are just short um, on an influence to hire Willy. So we have to wait one more turn. Um, but I probably have enough spare influence to take the other control point in Kazakhstan this turn, just so that I've got it. And I think that's it worth doing. We'll get Human yeah. to do it. Um, she's got 53% chance. I'm not going to spend any extra influence on that. On we'll get Jebediah to stabilize the nation. Ready for my mission. And I don't know what to do with in. Elant. Um, exactly, TRM. It's, uh, the UI does seem to be a little less jumpy, but the biggest problem with the UI before was when you had lots of space fleets, the camera used to fly you all over the solar system um, to look at your fleets. And it used to take ages to click through it all. I really don't know what to do with her. Um, she's good because she's got Purge, but I don't want to start Purging yet. She's got Defend Interest, which makes her useful. But she's not super useful. On oh, I'm really sorry. I'm going to have to jump away for two seconds. I'll be right back. Um, I'm really sorry. I will be right back. So sorry.
I am back. So sorry about running off like that. Just a minor emergency. All sorted. Okay, so we got the I got a new turn. We as I said, we're just off, which is really annoying. But I think I'm happy with everybody doing what they're doing. Let's confirm and unpause. Next turn we'll go to get Willy. And that's gonna get things going. I think oops, I think the text on this is a lot easier to read than it was in the past. I think this was a smaller text before. We actually have a deficit of Order water and volatiles, which are resources used for space construction because we're having to supply the spaceship. Um, okay, we, okay, but if that's coming out of our income, I think. Yeah, minus 0 0.067 from Habs. So we are losing money to um, space. Oh, we needed we to have... to take control. I didn't know you were trying to take control. Oh, yes, you were. Okay, I can start to see other factions taking locations across the map. We need to get on top of this. Okay, new turn. We have enough to buy Willy. So we will grab him. He's finally joined the team and now we need to get a name for him. So I'll just go to the name generator. Give me a counselor name, please. <laughs> I actually quite like this name for him. Name's Blonde. Okay, this is Blonde. Now, uh, we can't, we can afford Jolt Games, which gives plus one command. Command, no, it's an admin is the most important stat early game. So I'm not really too worried about grabbing that. We now have a full team. So what I want to do now is we want to get um, the Project Exodus support in Australia up. So we're going to get um, Nameless Blonde to come Your here orders. and do some public campaigning. Um, I don't want to spend too much money on this, but we'll get this up to like 72%. Making our case. Then we're going to try you. again to get, Kazakh get the other Kazakh standpoint with Human. 53% there. I can afford to actually spend a little bit of influence now because we're not Making saving the influence outside. up anymore. Jebediah will continue to stabilize Kazakhstan. Elin Danger might be might be up for being kicked Stay out of the fine. team, to be honest. Uh, they are really not... Not bringing me a lot. Unless someone can come up with a really good argument uh, as to why... Also, my chat has crashed, so I didn't actually realize people were still chatting. Let me see if I can get it to go again. Nope, let me load this chat. I've got backup chat. There we go. Okay, what are people saying? There's some traits of tank your apparent loyalty. Yeah. Look, Willie doesn't have the best traits. Um... Oh, hey, Mr. Okay, I'm just catching up on chat because my my in stream chat has crashed, but the chat in the, on the stream is still working, which is just a, a new one. Um, okay, Elan Danger. What are we going to do with Elan Danger? I mean, there's no way she can purge one of these points, um, can she? Zero percent chance to purge either of these. We need to crack down on them first. First of all, we need to get our public opinion up. She may be getting fired. I'm not going to lie. There's just little I can do with her. I can get her to surveil near Niger, Ivory Coast, Ghana, in Togo. It's somewhere. Here. This is it here. Yeah, that's Nigeria. Where's there it is? Okay, I'll get her to surveil here just to see if we can detect that alien. I missed the milk joke. Oh no! I always click a confirm assignments to to confirm the mission. Something I used to do all the time in the past. Control action costs zero influence by default. Pretend asset costs 20 influence. Gotcha, Zelenus. Also, hello. Good to see you. She's not really up to much, no. Indigenous are criminals, so she can't access special orgs. Apart from that, she's not up to much. You are right. There's really little she can do. Um, she has detected something here. Our research development team report, we now will undertake the Alien Flora project. Yeah. So she has detected alien life forms here. Um, that is something we want to research. So let's get... Um, let's change this oops, to Alien Flora. Um... Our biologists study the non life forms that are collected from several sites. And I'm actually going to put all of our research into that. Is an org that let her do more? Not There are orgs, but not at the moment. There's nothing showing up in the shop at the moment. We'll have another look after this turn is over. But I think I'm going to fire her. Things are stabilizing. Okay, Kazakhstan's calming down. Hopefully we can capture it. Alien, Victor, Alien Fleet Victor 1 is now in low Earth orbit. So there's now yeah, that purple ping. Their hearts and minds. Um, public campaigning is working in Project X, so it now stands at 14%. That's a big jump. That's an alien ship, and they've crashed into Earth. Crashed. <laughs> oh no, Miss Saps, no worries. 
Okay, hey Owen, how's it going? Alien vessels crashed down in the Manaus region in Brazil. Okay, lots of stuff. So that UFO arrived, flew all the way to Earth, and then just, for some reason, crashed into Brazil. How strange. It's almost like they planned it. Our presence is growing. And we got Kazakhstan. Excellent. That's a huge get. Um, that's going to get us some really early um, income. Okay, let me just match this up. I want to get the welfare up here. Um, they, actually, they actually have quite advanced education in Kazakhstan. The biggest problem they have is our government is authoritarian and there's a lot of subversion happening. Um, so if I get welfare popping up, I think that will help with that. Welfare... Um, could be welfare probably decreases inequality by... There's actually quite low inequality, so I don't actually need welfare that much. Um, I think unity is what we need. Directing versus unity point because of... Um, Investing in the unity will increase cohesion by 0 0.062 and decrease the government score by 0 0.014. It'll shuffle the one towards the faction of control points in this nation. Okay, let's let's do a little bit of unity. A little bit of knowledge. Actually, we don't need knowledge at all. Um, we'll do funding and we'll do mission control. I hope they don't TRM, honestly. I really hope they don't. We'll do something like that. I'll have to mess around with that. Okay. Um, so this turn, we want to protect the control points here. Actually, I don't think I can. We don't need to contact control points because no one can take this control point. We need to double down and focus on Australia. So if I get Human, okay. no, if I get Names Ready. Blonde to look at doing a crackdown, he has very low chance of success on a crackdown. I mean, I could spend info to get that to 12%. So actually, before we do that, I should check the orcs. So the only thing she can grab right now is Jolt Games, which is of no use to her at all. Um, which again, just... I'm really not not sure. Even if they just a ship almost opening up for like the first year with no explanation of what it's doing. Yeah, that would that would be scary too. Or did it drive by and drop something on Earth? That would also work. Okay. So um Elin Danger oh, yeah. is going to go to Brazil. And where did that alien crash? Here's the alien crash site. She's going to she can't she can't even go into the I alien know. crash site. Um can she, she definitely doesn't have investigating in activity. Standing by. No, it's either Human or Jebediah. We'll send Jebediah. No, we'll send Human to Where investigate the crash site. We'll send we'll Elan Danger find. to surveil this Where's point. Oh, there's the crash. Here, here's the ship crashing. And it just crashed. We're going to get her to surveil this area to see if she can detect anything. We're going to get Jebediah to continue to, to just bring down unrest Ready. in... Um, this country. We'll bring it up to 58 so it's 50 we'll chance. No, wrong country. Once I want you to do it here. In Kazakhstan. There we go. We'll make things safe. And then Blonde, I want you to Ready continue pushing public opinion in Australia. Let's get that up to at least a 75% plus. And let's do that. Jolt Games know, might be real. Some of the orgs are from Patreon. Yeah, thanks Dark QB. So some of the orgs are from people who either supported the game in its development or from the Patreon. Um, there's a few streamers that have orgs in this game and they're very usually very powerful. <laughs> to TRM. Um, okay, we've got a surveil complete. I don't think we picked anything up. No secret knives have been fed to the Manus region. Oh, my tea's gone cold. Okay, new project available. Our research and development team has reported that we are now to take the HAB Living Quarters project. This allows us to build quarters on HABs. I don't need to research that anytime soon. Order is returning. Critical success on Stabilized Nation. Um, so they're now down to subversion. We'll just need to continue pushing that. But that was a great role. We've moved the needle. Um, we're now at 22% public support in Australia. Um, so we're now getting the biggest chunk of the pie. Yeah, per Perrin's org was very broken, if I remember right. Here's what we found. And we've got the Xenology research from investigating the alien crash site. This point in the game is a little bit slow, but it will it will get going. Getting will it, getting names blonde was important. Okay, let's have a look at if we want to do a crackdown now, we've got a 15% chance of cracking down on humanity first. Unfortunately, the resistance have defended their control point here. If I spent all of our influence, we get that to 54%, it's still not quite good enough. So I want to continue to public campaign here. Get that up. Just keep pushing. Try to sway the public. Keep pushing the public Wait. opinion. We're going to get human. Um, so Kazakhstan is how's Kazakhstan? Okay, Kazakhstan still needs a bit of stabilizing. So I'm going to get both of these guys here to just stabilize We're Kazakhstan. Safe. Um, Ready. And I need to work out what to do with Elon Danger. 
They want us to take Ireland. I want to stay out of Europe. I want to take Asia, but I want to focus on Australia if I can. Hey, Nook, how's it going? Sorry, Nook. Um, and Elan Danger. What to do with Elan Danger? I think I'll surveil this location again just to see if we can detect anything. There are alien life forms here. Let's see if there's anything else we can pick up. When you do a surveil, it checks every square around where you're surveilling as well. So we may pick something up. Oh, okay. Game is going okay so far. We haven't got the best starting agents, which has slowed things down a little bit. Um, and my, my honestly, my start's pretty slow. I haven't claimed that many nations, um, but we do have Kazakhstan. Surveiling target area. Cool, that's what we're going to space. No rules against genetic engineered cat girls in space. Oh, playing Unicorn Overlord has ruined my chat. It has absolutely ruined my chat. It's going by Charles. What does that mean to you, Ram? Violence is abating. Yeah, there's a lot of, st a lot of stabilizing. You failed to stabilize, which is public really bad. Sentiment is increasingly with us. Okay, we're over, we've got over 25% of public support now in Australia. Um, new project available. We can now research information science labs. We could look at building one of those on um, Avalanche Breaker Station, but <laughs> yes, exactly, Shinova Mail. Well, good luck, Nook. Hopefully it does hold out. Okay. Uh, we could purge Israel, you're right, but I want to purge Australia. At your service. So looking at a purge here, um, we now have a 0% chance. Why is that happening? Why has that gone to 0% when it was higher before? Espionage, popular support. Mission difficulty is 6. Council district 5. Size of national economy. Difference in ideology. Oh no, there's a crackdown I want to look at. 19% on a crackdown. I can bump that up to a 72%. Ah, gotcha, TRM. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, Brian, the, the, the unicorn content is, is a bit crazy. Uh, thank you, Crash Test. Do we want to go for this now, 72%, or do we want one more turn of public support and just push it a little bit higher? That's going to cost me 32 influence. Let's save that. See if there's someone we can hire, actually, to replace um, useless McDanger. Um, we'll just do a public support. I'll bump that up to 78 again. I will tell our story. What's the up? Um, if we have a look here, there's Kusha Abedi. They've got Control Nation um, and nothing that else. We've got Kundan Munchunda. She's got Control Nation. She's got Public Campaign. She's got Inspire. Um, public Campaign. Just having another Public Campaigner right now would be very good. Our ships are not named yet because we haven't got any ships yet. Um, but I have a huge name list for them. Control Nation, Public Campaign. There's also Hostile Takeover, which can be very useful. Another Kingpin, but they have so much stuff, this Kingpin. Assassinate, Steel Project, Coup d'etat, Increase Unrest, Extract, Assault. Um, Tech Mogul here, Control Nation, Public Campaign. Um, it's hard to pick the right person to hire. There's a lot of Control Nation, Public Campaign people here. She's got Inspire as well. Is this, oh, it's a Filipino astronaut. I thought we said it was a North Korean astronaut. So there's a, there's a lot of astronauts in the shop. I wonder if we just wait till the shop is updated, which it should do soon. Um, I don't think there's any orgs. We can get Shinofen Books plus two Persuasion. That's a good pickup. We will grab that. Um, so now she's at Persuasion 10, which is the max. So um, that's made her really powerful. Do we actually want to give Shinofen Books? Hmm. I actually think we want to give this Two names blonde because that gets in persuasion nine, and that'll be very good for him doing crackdowns. <laughs> TRM. Okay, we're gonna hold out until the store updates, and we're just gonna keep pushing this nation for now. So, um, Hugh Man, I think we're just gonna continue pushing down the unrest in Kazakhstan until it gets down to about one. Storing order. Jebediah is going to do the Where same do thing. Where and do you need me? We're just going to get Elint to Stand do a uh, surveil. Puppy is barking in the background. She's just woken up um, and she thinks she's been abandoned. Because um, I was there with her when she went to sleep and she's woken up there's nobody there. So I'm just going to be a second while this turn plays out. I'm just going to go and tell her she's okay. I'll be right back. Setting a watch.
Okay. Yeah, she was, she just went to sleep in the other room while I was there, and if she wakes up and I'm not there, she thinks she's been abandoned and she starts howling. Um, so I just had to go and tell her that she was okay, and now she's going back to sleep. Or she might start barking again in a second, we'll see. Okay. Sorry there's so many interruptions to the, the gameplay, but that's Violence a first stream. Abating. The people will come to our side. Okay, we're up to 33% public opinion in Australia. We can surely start to take it. Um, energy lab research is available. I'm not doing any of these researches yet. They're not important to us yet. Um, science, social science labs are now available to research. We will do this research just when things get a little bit less busy. This turn is almost over. Okay. So we're up to 52 influence. Um... The aliens have rapidly become more popular in India, but I should investigate for inactivity yeah, there. So we could have um, aliens in India. Oh, she is a uh, she's a bull Arab staffy cross. She's a she's a rescue, um, and uh, she has a few a few issues from her previous life, but she's she's doing a lot better. Um, Standing by. If we look at a crackdown here now, twenty six percent. I could spend all of our influence to get that to seventy nine. Still don't think that's worth it. Ugh. I think I'm going to stay, save our influence for now Making on our case. getting hold of um, a new person. I am going to try and take control of Singapore, though. We're going to get you to continue to stabilize here. And I'm going to send Elin over to India. And we're going to go to the... Um, the indoor region, and we're going to surveil here, see if we can pick up any aliens. I can see the servants have taken New Delhi. That might explain why some people in India suddenly love the aliens. Eyes up. See if she detects anything. You can also fight wars on the Earth. That is a thing that can happen. Those tanks you see are armies, and when you gain control of the countries. Oh, we didn't get a public companion. Hmm. Critical failure. You can't actually get the armies to fight against each other, which is what is actively happening um, in Ukraine, unfortunately, because the game starts off with Ukraine and Russia at war, because um, it starts in 2024. It looks like Russia are actually winning. Support. Okay. We now have control of, complete control mission. of Singapore, which is great. Um, I'll just get the. Uh, this to match. Oops. Just want to get that space program up and running as soon as possible in Singapore. So we can get that mission control. We've detected a base at Pike's Last Stand on Mac on Make Make. I don't know where that is. Um, and there's a large space station um, and a base. A lot okay. Because so Deep System Skywatch is completed. By the modern world. Begin to understand so this is this lets us track aliens really far out in the system. Um, and that is now what has happened. We can now research. Uh, we can now research alien origin, which is something we want to research. So I'll change this project to alien origin. And I'm going to put fifty percent of our research into that. So what, what? Where is Make Make? What planet? What moon is this? Oh, it's a, it's a rogue body. Is this? Oh, we're very very far out. No, where are we? Yeah, we are, we are very, very far out. Okay, this is maybe the alien's primary base. Um, let's just go back to Earth. <laughs> so far away. She does look like a little bit like Avarasala. Nook, you're right. Outer system dwarf planet. Thank you, mishaps. Watching the sky and seeing lots of aliens. Yeah. Deeply watching the sky. Okay. Uh, new turn. We've got 66 influence now. If I wanted to recruit somebody... I think I want to wait for this, this batch to reset, is what I'm holding out for. So we'll keep working here. If I wanted to purge this point now with... Um, names, things up. Names, bon names Blonde. Oh, the turn isn't over yet. Not Rogue, just far away. Gotcha. So if I wanted to crack down this point, 28% um, base, I can afford to spend 6 influence. 1, 2... Three, four, so here, that gets it to a 59%, or I spend another turn increasing public opinion. I think I'll do one more turn of public opinion. I'll spend, well, it's actually already at 70%. Um, 
Um, I need to defend. This is going to cost me 20 influence. We don't need to defend this right now. We're good here because nobody can take this point off us. Uh, this point here, how are we doing? We're down to peaceful. I'll keep stabilizing Kazakhstan. Restore peace oh, no. to this nation. At your service. How is the unrest in Singapore, actually? Oh, Singapore is super peaceful. So let's get Jebediah okay. and um, Human to just to stabilize Kazakhstan. We'll make things safe. Um, and then Elin Danger you know. can just continue to not be very useful. I'll get her to move to the New Delhi region where the servants are. And I'll get her to surveil here. Surveilling target area. Welcome back, Reno. Good to see you. <laughs> nice listen at 1.25 speed. Mecha, 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 or make, make. Is that it? Hooper stomp. Mission to make, make. No, we're not. We're, we'll be a long time before we go there. The dreamer in me wants to believe it would bring a Fifty golden age across. of advancement and prosperity <laughs> for all mankind, but I'm a realist. I know better. Any race advanced enough to find us would be advanced enough to end us, likely without even regarding us. Commander Fiona Ayawade, NATO Symposium on First Contact. Okay. Uh, what I would say, Miss Haps, is we've just completed two research projects to get that deep system, so they've probably fast-tracked new ways of detecting stuff somehow. I don't know the physics or the science behind it. So the following projects may unlock to us in the future. Our current friends are unlocking projects. So clandestine cells. We've also got arrival domestic policies, arrival economics, arrival international relations. So this is all just stuff related to how humans deal with the fact that there are aliens in the system. What did they pick as a new research there? Oh, I don't want to sell resources to Earth. Outpost Habs, orbital shipbuilding, advanced carbon manipulation. Things we do need to get involved with this at some point. Kazakhstan is getting more relaxed. Order is returning. Public Never been on a fl Hey, ooh, how do I pronounce this? Um, Ekitia Kwop, aka Muju Defri. I, I'm sorry, I, I would love to pronounce that. I don't know how to do it. We'll fire a bunch of weapons at Mecha Maker Base as we fly past with our Exodus ship, exactly TRM. We're basically building what's the ship from the Expanse that gets hijacked and used to hit Ceres? Oh, they're trying to hit the Ceres, then it turns into a warship. Um, the one that the Mormons were building, that's what we're building. I can't remember the name of it. That is what we will be building as our long term goal. New Orgs, okay. Right, we have new orgs available. Let's check those out first of all. Um, we've got Pandora Marketing. That gives public campaign. That will make her useful. That's actually amazing. Um, there's also the Garisal Foundation. Gives 3% knowledge. And also gives the advice mission. Green Student Security gives one command. Latana Private Investigations gives Investigate Counselor, Investigate Alliance Activity, Detain Counselor, Surveil Location, and Plus One Investigation. Um, yes, I'm guessing it's... I don't know what... It, it's a global thing. That's what makes it weird, Miss Apps. <laughs> Thanks, Silvanite. Um, it's City in Arabic. Let's get Pandora Marketing on Elite Elin Danger. That gets her public campaign, which is just massive. I'm also quite tempted to get her Latana public in, um, investigations as well for plus one investigation, uh, which will which means that she can do some investigation missions for us. Um, three body problem is a it, it's in the news right now because it's it's a sci-fi book series about an alien race invading Earth essentially. Um, that's just had a Netflix series released about it. Yeah, I, I enjoyed it. The end was a bit, but I enjoyed it. Okay, let's 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 get to work. I don't need this influence to buy anyone right now because suddenly even danger is actually useful. Let's crack down this. Let's get this up to eighty-four uh, percent. Maybe we'll do an eighty percent. Going after their people. So we're gonna crack that. Crack this down. We'll get Elin here, here to increase public opinion. Um, now, what are we gonna do with the rest of our Your people? Orders? At your service. How are we doing? We've still got quite a lot of control points. Is there anywhere else in Asia we want to target right now? I think I was looking at Japan was just way too hard to start with. 2% chance in Japan. So we just start working. I think Japan's going to be our next target. Uh, it, did it get cancelled, Kules? Oh, you mean, sorry. Um, you're talk, we're talking about uh, the Expanse, yeah. Um, it's Naovo, that's right. Cool. The problem is a giant, yeah, cool, cool, cool. 
steal a thing and repurpose it enough times the name is bound to change. That's that's completely true. Um, yeah, the, 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 adaptation, the adaptation is pretty good. That's what I'll say. Um, I definitely enjoyed it. I think what they do, from what I understand from talking on the Discord, is that they... They, they involve the other books in a story that was originally told in one book, um, which can make it a little bit hard to follow, or just there's a lot going on. Um, we could grab Malaysia. We could maybe grab Thailand. I don't think I want to grab any of these. I think Human will just stabilize Kazakhstan for another turn. Um, order. And Jebediah will stabilize Kazakhstan for next turn for next turn We've to start to steal Australia is our operation for next turn. Operation Steal Australia. And bring it under Project, Project Exodus, and then we're going to build mission control centers all across the Australian outback, and then we're going to build um, rocket launch centers all across Australia. The situation I remains chaotic. I don't care that it isn't a good place we to launch rockets from. Interesting that we keep failing the stabilizations. I guess because it's so peaceful We've there now. Hit them where it hurts. And we got a crackdown. Excellent. So what a crackdown does is it basically removes any protections the nation has, uh, the faction has to protect themselves from owning the country. Public um, opinion remains. Unmoved. Which means that we can now take over ourselves. Um, ooh. Oh. Oh, I don't like that. Okay. Um, it looks like Israel and Palestine are at war in this game. Um, Who is controlling those nations? Uh, nobody is controlling... No, the resistance are controlling uh, Israel and nobody is controlling Palestine. So we have an Isra Israeli-Palestinian war just started, but we're going to just focus on... Uh, Australia just now. Um, God, that's that's. Uh, sometimes playing with a realistic world can be very uh, uncomfortable. So what we're gonna do? Oh, we have to finish the turn. Is it so obvious people think it's a bluff and target? It's actually Switzerland, indeed. Yeah, big oof. Don't like that. I feel like I might need to intervene. Um, I mean, we also we also have a war between Ukraine and Russia right now, um, which again I think Russia are winning. I don't think Ukraine has any armies left. Yeah, yeah. So I think we're just gonna have to ignore that, unfortunately, TRM, as uncomfortable as it makes me. Uh, Human is going to attempt. No, we need a crack. To, we need that? a purge. So you can purge with your perception of four. Or you can purge perception mission. nine. So we'll get you to purge. So purge is the special ability you use to gain control of a point from another faction. Um, and we'll just pump a little bit of influence into that. We want to make this pretty much guaranteed. So I will spend the 32 influence to make this a 72%. Targeting the opposition. Hey Polaris, wow, it has been a long time. How are you doing? Good to see you. Oh, Brian's getting a heist team together. Brian has gone in with the heist with paying one to get into the heist. By the way, if you use exclamation mark um, sounds, you can find out what you can spend your channel points on to play sounds. Um, just if, if that's a thing you want to do. Um, we'll get Elan Danger to continue to boost public opinion here. So better than money on that. We must persuade the people. Without I want yourself. more persuasion because there's not much else we can Standing do. By. Um, Human and Jebediah are a little bit... They don't really have a lot to do at the moment. Because I can't just grab nations willy-nilly. I want to really, really focus on what I grab. Oh, it looks like Taiwan. Can we grab a part of Taiwan? Can we grab the other one? 32%. I can spend some influence on that. Let's try and grab another part of Taiwan. And we'll get Jebediah. South Korea has been claimed. Japan is a no chance, isn't it? 2% chance to grab Japan. Good luck in the heist, everybody. Oof, that's that's tough, Polaris. I really hope you find something um, a little more suited ASAP. I'm just going to lower unrest in, a, in Australia. There's literally nothing else for him to do. Every circumstance oh, we found the initiative. Our test is to recognize and seize it. So the initiative is, as far as I can tell, it's it, it's capitalism. I mean, it's not as far as I can tell. The initiative is capitalism. Their entire um, their entire story, their, their their whole goal is to monetize the aliens, and that is their end end result is to subjugate the aliens and make money off them. That's a shame too. I just want to do it because free Taiwan, basically. Good luck on the heist, everybody. 
Casualties have fallen. Shinobu, cool ass, Silver Knight, and Crash Test made it out. Silver Knight made a lot of money on that mission. Come on, we need to get this. We need to get this purge. The needle. Okay, we're now forty-one percent public opinion. Look at the public opinion in Australia. They love Project Exodus. There are two types of people in this world. Alpha's tabs have been researched. That just means we can build bigger space stations. I'm doing it for RP, really. That's how it works, Crash Test. We still lack support. We failed to get Taiwan, so that question's dealt with. Our associates are now in charge. And we have purged out the humanity first from Australia. Which means we can now go after the executive control point and take control of the of the of the um of the country from humanity first slowly. The new normal. The initial global upheaval in response to the alien arrival has calmed somewhat, with various political and economic interests recognizing that whatever the aliens are doing, the end of the world is not immediately upon us. With a sense of emergency fading and entrenched power structures are reasserting their authority and humans are spending more time worrying about each other than the aliens. In short, our moment to strike quickly is passing. Our counselors report that their missions are taking longer to plan and conduct as we must navigate the old protocols for travel, security, and international contacts. <laughs> Thank you, Brian. Uh, we can still move forward and some of our missions will have a greater impact as we spend more time on them. But everything will take longer to accomplish now. The mission assignment phase will occur twice a month going forward. Okay. So everything's going to go a bit slower from this point onwards. That usually there's a um, yes, <laughs> cool s. What is 007? I don't think anyone has ever actually used that 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 sting. There is a um, it's, it's 007. Ah, uh, yeah, an absolute banger. Okay, well we want to get um, Nameless Bond to take the control point, and we'll just put that up to an 82. If you hear any noise. It is the cat rubbing up against the microphone. That's a long, a long voice one. Um, I don't actually have very many music ones left. I used to have quite a lot of them, but most of them are just sound bites now. We're going to take Australia. Uh, let's start getting public opinion up in Japan. So Elon Danger can come up to Japan and start pushing public opinion here, which is going to be very, very expensive and very hard. We'll make our appeal to start. Um, Sending by. It's on cooldown, unfortunately. You can't just spam the same one. I'm not that stupid. <laughs> uh, nothing we can buy here. Nobody has enough X. Oh, we have people have XP to level up, which is great. Um, okay. So you, we'll, we'll, we need to pump up admin on everybody so they can get more orgs. So we'll get one admin on you. Uh, actually, you can get two admin on you because you have 50 XP. You can get an admin. Um, although, do we want to get Persuasion on you early? I might get your Persuasion up just because it is very low, and then we'll come back for some more admin. Uh, you will get some admin. You can get an admin, and you can get an admin, and you can get an admin. And James Bond has a lot of very early XP, which is great, so you can get an admin. In fact, you can get two admin, take you up to ten admin right from the start, which is a great starting stat for him. We need more TF2 sound effects. Sound effects could hit that within fitting. <laughs> Kid to know something, yeah. <laughs> um, the, if you want to suggest more stuff to add to that, I'm more than willing to take it. Just pop them in the Discord. That's the way to do it. Okay, so Hugh Man um, has no chance in Japan. Yeah, 2%. There's just not a lot they can do. Let's just do a surveil in Japan, see if anyone else is working Shady on this location. And Jebediah, how is the... Okay, there's no need to worry about... <sighs> what to do with Jebediah? Contact orbit. Oh. Excuse me, that was a big yarn. Let's um, let's go to ground on Jebediah because everybody knows where he is. Evading pursuit. We also need to sort out our um, our, our priorities here. So we're going to just push space program. We need to get Australia's space program up and running ASAP, as well as we need to keep working on New Zealand's space program. Actually, New Zealand has a space program at the start of the game, which is alert, which is great. Um, and obviously, we are also working on Singapore's space program, and we're also working on mission control in Kazakhstan. That's the big ones. We need to get as much mission control as possible. It is such an important stat. Um, clandestine cells allows us to recruit an additional counselor, increases our control point command. Yes, 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 yes. Okay. Um, we need clandestine cells. ASAP. Um, new project available, Outpost Core. I don't care. Let's get all of our research into this. We'll just keep Alien Floor ticking over until it's finished. But most of our research is going to go into clandestine cells. You're going silent. That's fine. Uh, 
Um, okay. They have not come in peace. Images of obvious alien military ships and stretches in the far solar system as dashed hopes worldwide for peaceful contact. Many who wish to seek an avenue of cooperation with the aliens are changing their views in light of some of the first hard facts about their arrival. So this is if you're playing as the Academy, this is a huge knockback for you. Um, roughly half the control points below the Academy will suffer the crackdown effect for 12 months. The Academy suffers a massive loss in public opinion around the world. All nation cohesion moves toward one by one towards extreme values. So this is humanity coming to the faith that there is an alien invasion fleet here and they are here to get us. Which is pretty scary, if you think about it. We hold no sway in their mind. Okay, failed the public opinion campaign in Japan, which is a shame. Will we get the control point in Australia? Yeah, that's a turret. <laughs> Check Taiwan. The Academy has Taiwan. It's not cracked down, unfortunately. Good thinking, though, Crash Test. Thank you for thinking about that. That's why I keep it. all of you people around, because you think about stuff that I miss. We were unable to... Critical failure on, in taking control of... Um... Ugh, that's annoying. Rolled 99. Alien... Okay, we've got another alien fleet in orbit of Earth. That's that purple line. And they've crashed in Slovakia. Okay, we'll have to send Elin to go and have a look at that. That's the tune I remember. Yeah, the Academy are the optimists. Surely they come in peace if they advance so far in sciences. That's why I find them an interesting fashion, because they now need to change their whole ethos as to what they're going to do about the aliens when they discover that they're not here for peace and that their whole idea has unfortunately not been correct. In. So we're going to try and take this control. Says. Oh. Q-Man has no chance in Japan. She heard that we'll only she can, but her side. only idea was ham. <laughs> so so she go. went to convince a Saudi prince, but all she could convince was a lamb. <laughs> well done, T-Ram. That, that was impressive. Ready to go. I don't actually know what their endgame is, but I thought it would be quite interesting to go down. Okay, so Q-Man. What do we do with Q-Man? We've got an 89% on this control point. This is protected until the 15th of July, 2023. So it's almost available. That's oh, right, this game starts in 2022. Um, okay, what I'm actually going to do is I'm going to send Human to, to investigate time. this. And then Standing I'm going to orders. get Elint to surveil. Surveilling target area. And then Jebediah. There's not much for you to do at the moment, Jebediah. I don't think we need to worry about any any anybody being unhappy in any of our places. Just do a surveil for me in um, Australia. See if there's Eyes any up. enemies here. Pros is pros, TRM. <laughs> Stilted attempt at poetry. <laughs> She's only human after all. Oh God. Setting a watch. This is one of the better tracks, I think, on the soundtrack for this game. But I think I'll just play some Synthwave next time. I've heard these tracks so many times. The combat music's good, but it'll be a while before we get that. It's a funny game, because you kind of just set your turns up and then just let it run. You could get a little bit sick watching the, the skybox move here. Also, the game comes with uh, five different skyboxes. I'm using one of the alternate ones rather than the one the game normally starts with. There is Break even... Um, if we... We're taking over. Yes, we have control of Australia. Well, we have control of the executive control point in Australia, which is a very, very important one. We now need to defend Australia. So I'm just going to set this up as well. I'm not going to worry about economy, because Woolies and Coles control everything. Um, we're just going to focus on space program. Okay, um, can, Elint, can you do a defend interest for me here? Actually, no. We're going to get Your Jebediah honor. to defend interests here. Securing our control. Then we're going to send Elint up here to do a public campaign in Japan. Let's push this up. To, oof, God, it's going to cost 40 to get a 50%. I'm just going to do a 30% on her. It's probably not going to fire because I want to spend the money on him. He has a much higher chance of success. And then that'll make it easier for her. Standing by. Um, and then human. The aliens are clearly an essential threat to us. Look how they bombard our planet with their own ships. Their broken bodies and pulped organs are obviously an attempt to intimidate us. Indeed. 
Uh, that is, I did that last time Game of Cain, we had absolutely no fights. I'm also deliberately leaving Europe and America to the AI, uh, which could backfire horrendously because that means they will have the nukes and I won't. But it, I'm hoping it means that they will develop better and they'll be um, in, a, in, a, in, a, in a position where they can actually contribute to the game because apparently they will do more in this patch, but they need to have the, back, the, the, the development to do it, which they have just never had in the gameplay I played through before. Um, I have to make sure I'm playing um, music that has no that has a lot that I that I can license on my stream. Otherwise, the stream will get demonetized. So I have a specific playlist I can play of stuff. Oh, I get you totally, Polaris. I loved Hard Space. I had so much fun playing that game. Okay, Human. What are we going to do with Human this turn? Uh, we're protecting Australia. Is New Zealand protected? New Zealand is not protected. Let's protect New Zealand. I didn't realize New Zealand was protecting unprotected. Our interests. That's a big one. Ah, it just happened this turn, that's why. Okay, let's unpause. The countries that are triangles are like city states. So for instance, this is Singapore. Securing our interests. The Securing AI will actually do stuff, TRM, if they get the start. Defend interest mission complete. We're just going to get our public camp. We're going to start take, going to go take over Japan as our next target. It's also used for like small islands. For instance, this is um, uh, Tenerife. This is uh, um, Capo Verde. Uh, I think there's some stuff over here, like um, the Poly Polynesian states, which are controlled by is increasingly with us. the servants who are cracked down right now. They must have got over their mission control amount. Not the mission control, their control point amount. Okay, public, we now have 12% public opinion in Japan. So they gonna need to crack public that one. Is moving in our Excellent, 20% public opinion in Japan. That'll make life a lot easier. Yeah, it's it's for putting stuff in small states so you can see it being built, exactly, crash test. This is a new track, I think. I don't think I've heard this one. Space Flight Program Initiative. Australia has joined the Space Ferry Nations by launching a small satellite to orbit. Factions may begin building boosted mission control there. Hopefully, mis mishaps. Um, apparently they are. Okay, so we can now take all of this this investment into boost away, and we can focus on investing into mission control. Uh, military science nab, lab, <laughs> military science nabs are now available for research. Again, we're gonna leave all that for now. Really, we need to focus on the one we're actually working on. The free people of Australia will no longer be controlled by the avian overlords. How will the emus defeat us at war if we can fly and get attacked from space? Okay, name's Blonde, Director. <laughs> the marketplace. Oh, we got new orcs. We have new orcs. Orcs, orcs, orcs. Uh, what have we got? Oh, nothing we can afford. Uh, we are pretty low on cash because I'm spending it all on influencing. I'm, I'm, I'm spending it all on TikTok campaigns in Japan, um, which is costing me a lot of money. So, and where to? Can we actually do a control points here? No, we need to continue to influence Japan. We need to get them to love us. Let's do that to 80%. He sounds Probably a little up. bit like, um, Ready for orders. what's his name? Um, the guy from um, Matt, the guy from, uh, Matt Berry. He sounds a little bit like Matt Berry doing like a South African accent or German accent. Let's get Elint to also public campaign in Japan. I know it costs a lot of money to get her to do it. I'm really low on cash, but I will just roll it on the 30%. Story. Ready for my mission. Okay, then we've got Human and Jebediah. Um, Australia is protected, New Zealand is protected. Um, so that's all good. What can we do with these two? There's not really a, a lot for them to be doing right now. Um, wait, wait, wait. Oh, I thought this, I thought I had an 83% chance. Was that an 83% chance to take over? I'm not sure why that was an 83% chance for. Um, let's surveil Japan to see if anyone else is working on it. Initiating recall. And let's also surveil... Where do you need me? There's an agent here. Let's see if we can identify whoever this agent is. Initiating recon. Does the game consider the Vatican to be its own state? Let's have a look at Italy. No. Uh, Albania, Macedonia. No, the Vatican does not. We've got Rome. Rome is its own area, but it is not its own state. 
Um, unfortunately. Because it totally is, but not really relevant to space war. But it would be funny if I poked up a military space program. It would. Indonesia? Um, I think... Oh, hang on. Give me a second. That's Malaysia. Yeah, Indonesia is basically made up of all of this. So it's kind of all been rolled into one. Um, but you've got four states. You've got quite a lot of regions. You've got Medan. You've got Jakarta. You've got Den Pasar. You've got Samarinda. You've got... Um, Makassar, and you've also got Biak, and then there is also Papua New Guinea, which I believe Australia has claims on, um, so we can start taking it over. Do we still have the Star Sector playthrough? Yeah, look, I, I, that, that's on hiatus at the moment. Um, there's a lot of things I'm working on. I still have High Fleet, and I still have Nebulous, and I still have more Xenonauts to do. Manor Lords is watch. gonna continue for a little while. There's a, there's a lot going on. It's it, I am very busy. Initiating surveillance. But I quite like it. As long as I don't burn myself out. Yeah, true. I just started showing how they how they'd actually arrange it all. I think it used to only be two sections, so they've they've, they've added a lot more regions. Alien flora. There's limited amount to be gleaned from our study of the vegetative life form we have to dub Xenoflora, but not a lack of trying. The issues we have thus far been unable to fully crack a genetic makeup for, or elements thereof are so, for better luck, alien as to be thoroughly inscrutable to the present time. Neither have we been able to divine any clues to its origin other than to say that it is most certainly not of this earth. So it just gets us information about Xenoforms. Um, I will put down... We'll probably start researching stuff related to space at a very slow rate just so that that's ticking forward. We do need to get involved in all of this. Do you think so, Gamer Kane? Maybe. The people will come to our side. Okay, up to 25% public opinion in Japan. That's good. Ah, there you go. East Timor is missing. The people will come to our side. And up to 29% public opinion in Japan. It's a really tough nut to crack Japan. It's like America. Send a new alien fleet at on one of the planets. Oh, Kiev asked for help during its spring blizzard and no one gave it to it. That makes me feel really sad. One of the first things I did in my last playthrough Long was end that war. Were a blow of doctors and treatments. By that point. Every movement was painful. The one thing she loved was her aquatic therapy. Whenever I was home on leave, I'd take her to the pool for hours. Weightless. Smiling. Free. Commander Fiona Ayawade, during a psychological evaluation. So, orbital ship building is now available, which also unlocks principles of space warfare and a whole ton of research projects, which will pop up from time to time. So ships are now... Oh, oh no. Ready I, for my mission. Can we actually design ships now? No, we still can't design ships yet. Okay, any chance we can crack into Japan? Oh, the game is taking a long time to close that window. How long is a turn? A turn is a month. A uh, turn is, is two weeks, actually, at this stage of the game. Um, all right, want. Can we control here? 10% chance for a control nation on Japan. Which I can knock up to a 61. Uh, let's continue pushing up that um, public campaign then. We'll get you to do an 80% chance. I will tell our story. Elin Danger is doing very Ready well considering she keeps doing she keeps Ready. rolling 30% attempts. Ready to um, go. Human. Reporting in. Still really know what to do with you guys. Thanks, thanks, Polaris. I appreciate you confirming that for me. Um, okay, we've actually managed to identify, we've managed to identify, oh, <laughs> did the game accidentally show me? No, we've managed to identify a, um, a servant agent here, but I don't think I have I anyone it. who can take action on that, sadly. Um, the servants are all over India. Have they got China yet? They don't have China, but they do have India. They usually take China, they usually get given China. Um, I do have a lot of influence to spend. That is true. What if I what if I get human to tr give in an attempt just to see what happens? It's a fifty percent attempt. Let's just let's just roll the dice we'll on a fifty. In no time. Um, and then if I go into my nations window, 
I can just quickly check what our what our um, unrest is at. So Kazakhstan's unrest is building a little bit. So we will just send um, Jebediah up to Kazakhstan and get him to nope. We'll get him to um, stabilize. We'll make things safe. Bridge time. It, it's it would be bridge time if I had someone who could bridge. I still have a lot, Jebediah. It's worth a try. Always worth a try. We always roll the dice. That's how I like to play. All right, Nook. Thanks for dropping by. I appreciate you dropping in. <laughs> so the bridge has been hit. Violence is abating. Our case remains unhurt. Failed the public campaign roll, unfortunately, in Japan this turn, it's costing us a lot of money. Our case remains unheard. Both public campaign rules failed. Uh, okay. Our research development team are now able to untake Interplanetary Warships product, which gives us 30mm auto cannons, 6 inch cannons, 10 inch cannons, um, heat sinks, uh, crate missile bays, uh, radiators, and can build gunships, escorts, and corvettes, which is hilarious. Imagine going after the aliens with a 6 inch auto cannon. Hey Razorback, uh, patch is so good so far. Oh, that's that's pretty sad. The Palestine has been conquered by Israel, which is just ugh. Sorry, you had to join to that, Razorback. We were unable to establish control. It is a way to do it. I just don't have anyone who can control armies, and I don't have. Well, I've got access to Australia, so I don't even have access to Australia's armies yet. New orgs in the marketplace, we need to check that out. And then we can buy. There's some good stuff in here though, if we could actually save the money up to get it. That's a 30mm, that's right. This is just a cannon, straight off a World War I tank. I quite like this, they've changed it up, so even though everyone is in Japan, they've got different backgrounds now. You can see the Tokyo Tower there, but um, you that, that's really cool. It looks like they've taken a real picture of the location and then they've put a filter on it, which I don't have a problem with. I think that's quite a good way of getting the artwork there. Is anyone even ready for a level up? Yeah, you are. Let's get your persuasion up so you can actually do a better job of convincing people. You also have, we'll get your admin up. You're not ready to level up yet though. <laughs> that's, that's true Polaris. Um, I'm worried that I'm spending a lot of time investing in Japan and not making any progress. Standing by. But I'll keep pushing. I will try to sway the public. Now, Elin Danger. Where did that Standing agent go? Because Elin Danger can investigate unknown targets. We'll see what they're up to. Let's see who they okay, are. Sorry. Some of the backgrounds are wild later, cool. That's definitely a change from the uh, last time I played the game. So June, this um, control point is going to become purgeable. I need to keep that in mind. That's a really important date. Um, human can attempt to control. Again, I'd have to spend pretty much all of my influence to do it, and it would be a 50% chance. It's for 64 influence, it's just not worth it, unfortunately. Um, at the moment, I don't see the point. Jebediah What's the op? can continue to stabilize Kazakhstan. We'll turn down the heat. Um, human, I might just get her to like do an advise. Um, yeah, we'll just do an advise in Australia. It, it's like whatever. Lending my expertise. I wish our space game could be more about finding other factions in space. Me too, Razorback. I really do think that would be really cool. Yeah, again, Polaris. Especially because what I did last time was I. I raced for the moon. I took the moon over before anyone else could get there. And then I went back and destroyed everyone else's bases on the moon anyway. Um, and invaded them with marines. Like, Just imagine, oof. my Fetchy, how this world would change if we could mass manufacture building materials in an instant. Homes built for mere pennies. Irrigation for every village. A brighter, fairer future for all. Commissioner oh. Kiran Banerjee, private correspondence. So that's advanced carbon manipulation done, which gets us access to carbon nanotubes and also composite armor and graphene batteries. These are both very good researchers, if I remember right. 
That would be cool. So there's a graphene battery available. How long do we have left Offering on... Assistance. Oh, never mind. Didn't mean to do that. How long do we have left on clandestine cells? Still a while. That's a really important research. We've got some intel on our target. Um, who do they work for? We'll be ready for new orders soon. So we found a resistance agent here. That could be useful to me. T-Rem says, old human has got a plan. <laughs> She's here to take over India. But the servants are trouble and the government's befuddled cause the blighters got here before her. <laughs> I like your little limericks. I thought it was a limerick. I like your little... Um, is it a rhyme? And minds. Is it a poem? Oh, critical success public, ca public campaign. That's great. So we're up to... 40% um, of Japan loving us. Might be worth trying to take over now. Yes, uh, exactly. And new part and particle weapons as well. I'm really happy they merged those tiers. There was just so much to research before. The game also seems to be running really smoothly, but it was also very early in the campaign. And when I did it last time, it was way wet. Um, honestly, cool ass. I have so many games on my tape plate right now. I need to get some of them finished before I pick anything else up. Um, it's bad enough that I've come back to this, honestly. Okay, Singapore. Does Singapore need protected? Where is Singapore? Here it is. No, it's fine. They can't do anything about it. Um, it is now May, so next month um, this city becomes available for us to attack. I want to see what we're looking at Ready for, for a mission. control point mission here now. 17. 76%. I'm going to take Putting that. Our people in place. Um, Standing by. Standing by. Their attempts are the most cool. Uh, everywhere else should be protected. Kazakhstan should be protected. Yeah, it is. Uh, Infection Free Ready. Zone is a zombie survival game that uses public um, geo maps Ready. to let you place your base in your neighborhood or the city center that you're in and actually have all the buildings modeled. Um, it, it's a really cool, um, it's a really cool idea. It's something I've seen a few people trying to do like online, but it's actually an actual game of it, um, which makes it all the better. There's nothing I want to do with humanity in danger this turn, so I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna go ahead. We'll see if we can grab Japan with human. Oh, with um, names blonde. That's the big one. Oh, we can now build space docks. Oh, we can now build supply. Well, research supply depots. There's a lot of space stuff we now have access to research, but I'm wanting to focus on um, just getting the Earth side of the game sorted first of all. We only have two mission control at the moment, and that means we just can't. Mission control is the stat that lets us put things into orbit, and like that's mines, that's mines, that's space stations, that's habitats, and that's combat ships. So we need to get countries under our control and develop mission Order control in them so that we can get ships into space. Um, until we do that, we're not able to compete. And this is definitely a much slower start than last time. The, the When I played it, Last time, we, I think we probably had like half of Europe by this stage. I just raced through capturing Europe off and didn't let any of the other factions get hold of Europe. Um, and then I formed the um, European Eurasian Union, and it was great. Okay, we now get Xenoflora defoliance. 25 percent bonus damage to Xenoforming. Any attempts to plant Xenoform suffer minus two penalty. That's pretty good, but we're not going to pick that up yet. Is there another space station in orbit? What is, what is in orbit right now? Oh my goodness. Did, did humanity first build a space station already? Uh, well, this is, this, this is, this is, this is a surprise. Humanity first have built a space station. Um, and it, did the initiative build one as well? Yes, the initiative have also built a space station. Yeah, they're they're both the, the this is this is this is the core under construction. To compare it, just so you can see the difference, if we go and have a look at Tycho Station, which is the one we started with, it actually looks like an old-fashioned space station because it's technically like a tier zero station. Like, there's nothing we can do with it at the moment. Uh, well, actually, we built some labs on it. So we have, we already have, it is May 2023, 
and the Initiative and the Humanity First are moving into space. And I am nowhere near ready to compete with that. Huh. That's a big change. So for those who don't know, the AI in this game has never been very good. And the other factions basically did nothing. Um, maybe we should switch sides. Okay, well that's, that's, that that's is a concern. Is growing. We've gained a control point in Japan. Um, this is new art as well. Uh, that's really cool. Really, really cool. Up here. Now that we've got one control point in Japan, it makes getting in easier. Um, I don't think we need to worry about anything here. We're just going to focus on getting mission control built. Predictable. <laughs> that predictable made me laugh. Just going to focus on mission control. Okay. It doesn't seem too hot now, does it? No, it doesn't. No, it doesn't. But it's okay because we're going to take we're going to take Asia Pacific to space. Um. All right. That's crazy. What, what, what a development. We've taken Japan. We've taken one control point in Japan. And our enemies are, are stepping into orbit. It should actually be here. If I look through the, the history, it'll probably show up somewhere. And it doesn't say anywhere. It doesn't say anywhere. I don't see anywhere where it says that they've built something. Wow, what a what a surprising move. Um, all right. Uh, name is Blonde. Can you take another control point for me? It's a 69 percent establishing control we'll give that a try Ready um, for my mission. next turn this is going to become available uh i wasn't planning on going for china but i might end up having to we'll just see how it plays out obviously nobody has touched america yet because america is so hard to deal with however i've seen reports that america falls to civil war if it's left unattended for too long <laughs> because they are currently a flawed democracy and they have very high inequality and their their cohesion is really fractured. So I have heard that America will, if left unattended, um, fall to civil war and split in, and, and it will um, split up. So we have, to be, we have to be careful about that. Oh, I can't believe that there's other factions in space right now. Your that, orders? That is really, un, really unexpected. Can I afford any of the... Um, no. We're gonna save our money for a bit. Um, there's nothing I want to do with our other people. I mean, we could probably Quite get Human up. to just make an attempt on a control point here. I don't really have any influence for her to spend on it. Um, but she can roll the dice on, the, on, board. on a 13%. At your service. And Jebediah can Ready roll a 10%. Order. They're not gonna get it, but we Ready may as well try. Mission. Getting Fosco's figures is second best the real thing, so we'd have to set a priority straight. Yeah, I guess. Yeah, exactly, TRM. I mean, they hit the nail on the head with uh, some other stuff that's happened in this playthrough already. Sad as it is. Let's see if we get any any inroads into Japan here. <laughs> Everyone's like, yep, right, agrees. Let me just check what's going on on Twitch. Yeah, nothing, nothing has happened on Twitch. That's fine. I just wanted to make sure that we could stream to Twitch. And I think we have been able to. Let me just check if the stream is actually running on Twitch. Oh, is that a super chat from someone? Yeah, the stream is running on Twitch. I missed the super chat. now has three colored factions off. What's happening? Oh my god, I'm so confused. Okay, Brian super chat. Oh my god, Brian, thank you so much. <laughs> The, the you're wasted sound effect really broke my brain. The tech icon now has three colored faction dots. Yes, it does. It's amazing. Um, I really like this because it tells me who is working on it. Um, and also, thank you so much for the super chat. I, I really, really appreciate that. I got so confused there. <laughs> uh, once armies to a nation that splits up anyway, the armies are based in regions and whoever gets those regions gets them. Basically. Uh, thank you so much, Brian. You're a legend. Come on, if your fingers crossed for a complete sweep here, we take all of Japan. Um, there are also lots of engineering projects available to us. I think there's going to be some... To take control. Okay. That's the most likely one. Major flooding. Major flooding in the Auckland-Wellington region. Auckland-Wellington region of New Zealand is experiencing cataclysmic flooding. Thousands of people are stranded and local infrastructure suffered major damage. We will, of course, deploy it. Oh, no, I can't deploy a team to do anything about it. So we're going to have to take the damage. Um, that's bad. 
Our supporters are in place. Oh my god, we one of the ten percent chances to get control of Japan actually worked. Cleaning things up. Amazing. Getting Japan would be such a coup for us, because it'll give us such a great income. <laughs> Everyone's having fun with the sound effects now. Okay, we've got two of the four control points in Japan. All right. Ugh. I hate to do this to everybody, um, but it is now midnight and I have work in the morning. So this is what I usually do with my weekday streams is they're just for two hours. Um, but I think we've got to start here. I'm very excited to see what our opponents do with their um, space stations. Uh, they have very really surprised me by doing this. Um, that was New Zealand TRM, not Australia. Um, if we just have a look at the nation states. Um, okay, that was actually a mistake. I wanted to see, this is the not wrong place to go. If we just have a look at Intel. Uh, we don't really know anything about anybody, do we? Yeah, we don't really know anything about any of the factions. But yeah, I'm, I'm going to head to bed because it is late for me. But this is a good place to stop. I want to continue st streaming Terra and Victor. I'm not sure if I'm going to do it once a week or twice a week. Um, but the slot works for me. Uh, it's just a nice way to end my evening. I've been looking forward to doing this all day. I'm really happy to see that the Twitch side worked, even though nobody watched on Twitch. I don't really care. It's good to know that that works. I actually have a second bot running on Twitch, um, which has its own, like... You could actually switch to the Twitch to do another heist if you wanted to. Um, but thank you all for tuning in. I really appreciate it. Brian, thank you so much for the super chat. I hope you're ready to be a Xenonaut soldier because you've joined the naming list. And I will see you all in the next video, which I think will hopefully be a Xenonauts or a High Fleet if I get it sorted. Um, don't, don't tell that to New Zealanders, t -Rab. Um They will not like you for that. Don't let uh, Winter will find out that you said that. <laughs> all right, everybody. Um, I hope you have a wonderful day. Thank you all for tuning in. We had like 60 people at one point on this stream, which is insane. Like I never have that many people tuning in on a YouTube stream. Um, don't forget that we've got Unicorn Overlord um, on the weekend. The timings for that are on the Discord and I'll get some more other stuff out this week as well. I'm playing Netrunner tomorrow though, so I won't be able to record. Um, Wednesdays are definitely a day off. Um, I'm also going to be at DreamHack. Uh, I know I watched a waffle at the end of the stream. I want to be at DreamHack Australia. So if you are interested in me checking anything out there, let me know. Um, and I'll post about it on Twitter. Um, and next time we'll, uh, we'll get some Synthwave going, I think, because we'll get some new music. All right, everybody. I'll catch you later. Ciao for now. See ya.